This is a great tool if you want to clarify the meaning of a word or phrase. It's one of my favorite technologies and I use it almost every day. You put the phrase or word into Youglish and it will give you a list of YouTube videos with that phrase and you can play them one after the other and see the phrase or the word being used in context. It does a lot more to watch this video. This is an absolutely brilliant tool if you want to clarify the meaning of a word or you want to find lots of examples of that word being used. You can search on Youglish for a particular word or phrase and then Youglish will return as many YouTube videos that it can find that have got that phrase in it. And that way you can listen and watch and see those phrases or those words being used in context. I literally use this technology on a daily basis. Today I used it twice. Let me show you how it works. And the other great thing, this technology works in multiple languages. So notice if you click here, you've got multiple languages. We'll do this in English. I'm just gonna write in a word that I'm gonna search for. I'm gonna search for the word disappointed. Okay, so let's imagine I wasn't sure about the meaning of this word. I'm going to click on say it and immediately I need to do. I'm going to get a whole series of videos where I can clearly see that phrase or that word being used. So I can click here and move on to the next phrase. So let's say I want to go to the next one. I just click here. But sometimes we get disappointed in this age of instant gratification when we don't feel as if every I'm going to pause I'm going to go on to the next one we're going to be incredibly disappointed in whatever I wrote next because it wasn't going to be eat pray love okay and then I can just click on like that now I'm going to show you a brilliant trick that you can also do here is that if you for example find a video that you really like and you think wow I want to know more about that channel or that video just right click and you can copy video URL and then you can go over to that video on YouTube and check it but I'm going to show you now something else that you can do with Youglish some people don't realize that you can also search for a whole phrase. So I've written in disappointed with the results and now all my returns are disappointed with the results. And a lovely thing of course is that you can see the sentences as you're playing them here at the below, but you can also copy that sentence if you, for example, wanted to collect together maybe 10 phrases with the word disappointed with the results. You could do that by copying obviously copy and then move on to the next one and, and then copy that disappointed with the copy that etc so lots of things you can do with this technology it actually does a lot more and if you want to look down here you'll see that it does more things but that is the way that I particularly use this technology and remember you can use it in lots of other languages I use it in Polish in Spanish in French if you want more free videos on how to use technology in language teaching, please come over to teachertrainingvideos.com. There's loads of content, including a special section of AI videos. If you really want to follow my work, sign up to the newsletter. If you sign up to the newsletter, at the moment there is a free 14-part video course in how to use technology in language teaching where I focus on most of the best free tools that are available. There are no tricks and you get sent one video every three or four days.